Hello, good afternoon and welcome to another update from me, James O'Connell, Principal TCS Exeter Road. I'm standing on the field here on Tuesday the 9th of July, it's uh, wrong, Friday the 9th of July, it's sports day and I just wanted to say how wonderful it is to have again another indicator of life getting back to a bit more normality. Lots of boys and girls have been competing, having lots of fun and pushing themselves. We've had year 7s and 8s up here at the beginning of the morning. Now we've got the year 9s and 10s doing welly wang, javelin, egg and spoon race, 100 meter sprints, 800 meters and a series of other events. And we're looking forward to the relays to finish the day. Really good to see so many boys and girls really enjoying themselves. And that's just one indication of things getting back to a little bit more normality. We've got Duke of Edinburgh's expeditions happening last weekend and this. We've got another year. 10 music concert happening next Thursday and looking forward to some more good fun events towards the end of this term. We are going to continue with our current measures in place for the rest of this term. You'll be aware that the national guidance is changing and so is the guidance for schools. I'm glad to say that come next year we should be able to return school to a normal situation in terms of no longer talking about the strangeness of bubbles and being able to have everyone on breaks at the same time. Just in the meantime, young people do need to continue using the lateral flow device testing and we will be giving out more of those so young people can do continue over the summer when they need. They don't need to keep doing it twice unless they're coming into school. When we get back in September, we are still going to have tests to give out and uh, we will continue with testing at least until the end of September. And there is an expectation that we test everyone in school twice when they get back in September. So that's something we're working on at the moment. I will get a letter out in this next week so you've got some more guidance about what's coming up the summer and the way ahead. The last day of term is going to be a shorter day, so we'll finish for one o'clock for students so that we can say a series of goodbyes and get things ready for the summer. But in the meantime, I hope that you and your children will enjoy the end of term and also be able to really enjoy the summer holiday. Thanks again for all your support and I look forward to speaking again soon. Bye for now.